Hello guys, it's your boy Lee Wins here and today's video we're going to be installing something fun. My clutch been acting funny lately, so I just wrapped my clutch. It wasn't really with the clutch, but I need another clutch too. That shit would fly, like done. So I got myself a whole clutch. And uh, not clutch, but I forget what I call, but oh fuck, I forgot what's this called. <laughs> And I also got the mm, cylinders and all that. This. Oh, yeah, you could already guess. It's from me, baby. And I got some nouns too. I got the line. I couldn't. I, yeah, I could not. It cost me about 80 bucks, but for 80 bucks, you get this big old line. Better than this, the stock one. Sign me up, man. So, yeah. So first thing we're going to do is figure out if this let's say that it will fit just like your stock one but what i want to do i want to do a tuck so i want to run this to my um fender yep to my fender and uh, to my song i forget what it called cylinder i my the name is on my to this yeah so now let's get oh shoot i got something else too which let me show you guys. This is a battery relocation. So my battery is gonna go on the side next to my pumper now. It's a risk of shit, you know. Going fast, boys. But I do it for more space, so this is what we're doing today. Not three store. This is for another day. These three. Let's go. Go in and remove. We need to make sure the line will see. So this is where the old one is. So I'm trying to put it on the firewall, then run it to the fender, goes around to go to the head. But let's see how this is gonna work out. Got the, I keep forgetting what this is called, but I already took it out and I took everything here, the end tag, the battery, and I took the first line for my head was connected from right there and also it's connected right here and it goes around the firewall and i also what i did i, I removed this that's the old one so you know it was kind of a base to come off so i just cut it so now i just gotta remove it from the firewall back there but it's kind of a bit so what i'm gonna do is i'm going to cut it right here once i remove my um engine i'm gonna clean it so now this is where i already there was a hole in it already a hole i just whitened the hole so now this the line gonna go from there to there just like this gonna follow there then go like there then go around here then come right there oh you guys can see it then come right here so this is what we're working on today. Now, we just gotta figure this out, cut this out. So we could have something to work with because um, I look you wanna take this out, but it's kind of hard to get behind those. So I'm, I'm gonna figure it out a way somehow. I got um, the line cut up. So this is cut from there to here because to get on here, it's really difficult. The whole engine would have to be down. So we don't wanna do that yet, but we're gonna do that soon. So now I'm just gonna feed this. Just gonna fit this to my little hole I made uh, right here. Just gonna fit the whole thing in there. because we got to finish boys fit the whole thing in there and then a little space because i have to connect to the cylinder oh my god now i know the name so this is gonna go like this around there goes like this go around i'll show you guys so yeah let's do this so there it is you guys uh -huh. the line comes right here runs around goes around there and then boom, inside the engine bay, and boom to the coastline. So yeah, this is it, people. But whoever kiss, 
inventive zip tie, zip tie. If I could kiss you, bro, I would. Shit. But damn. One last one done. So yeah. Hey guys, this is where I'm gonna end the video. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.